Lupus is a terrible disease that torments millions of people around the world, and knowing the symptoms soon enough to get treatment is crucial for each and every patient. In this video, I'll explain to you what the symptoms of lupus are and some advice on what you can do if you have this condition. Hey guys, Dr. Gus here, naturopath, acupuncturist, conventional doctor, and founder of DrLandivar.com. In this channel, as a conventional doctor, I treat my patients through natural medicine, homeopathy, and acupuncture before recurring to the use of pharmaceutical drugs. So if you're new to my channel, consider subscribing and press that bell down below to receive notifications and be the first one to watch a new video. If you need an online appointment or supplements, visit DrLandivar.com or comment down below. All right, so let's get into today's subject. What are the symptoms of lupus? I encourage you to stay till the end of the video where I'm gonna reveal important facts about recognizing the symptoms, okay? Okay, number one, fatigue, all right? People with lupus tend to feel tired and low in energy all the time. This is a very important symptom. Number two, fever. Uh, number three, joint pain, stiffness, and swelling, okay? And lupus can be confused sometimes with rheumatoid arthritis due to its symptoms, all right? Number four, butterfly-shaped rash, okay? And this is very important. The butterfly-shaped rash on the face is the most characteristic symptom of lupus, and it may cover the cheeks and bridge off your nose. Some may even have rashes all over the body, okay? Number five, skin lesions that appear or worsen with, a sun, with sun exposure. And this, by the way, is called photosensitivity, okay? Number six, fingers and toes that turn white or blue when exposed to cold or during stressful periods. This is called Renaud's phenomenon. Number seven, shortness of breath. Number eight, chest pain. Number nine, dry, uh, dry eyes, okay, and dryness. And finally, but not least, number 10, headaches, confusion, and memory loss, okay? And sometimes, something very important to know about lupus symptoms is that no two cases of lupus or in patients are alike. And this makes it very difficult to diagnose. Signs and symptoms may come you know, and suddenly develop slowly or even come and go. And it may be uh, for some permanent and for some very, very, uh, may vary, okay? So it's very hard and uh, to diagnose lupus. That's, that's why it's so hard to diagnose lupus, okay? And the signs and symptoms for lupus that you experience will depend on your, uh, what your body is affected, what, what in your body system is affected. So as you can see, it can be very tricky to diagnose and treat also. All right, so if you need information on how to treat lupus naturally, check out my other videos on the subject where I'm gonna talk about the best diets, treatments, and natural remedies, okay? And all sorts of good stuff like that. And if you need an online appointment or supplements for your lupus, visit drlandivar.com. I'm, lo I'm looking up to do formulas that are good for the, for the disease. And if, if there's a subject that you'd like for me to discuss, leave a comment down below and I'll be happy to upload a video on that request and help out the channel by giving it a thumbs up and sharing it with your family. Don't forget to subscribe below. I have many more videos coming your way on how to treat diseases naturally and um, effectively. And thanks for watching, you guys. We'll see you soon.